People say it takes day of research, testing and stress to find a viral product but I wanted to say them they were wrong. So I set a timer for 10 minutes, hit record and told myself to find a product worth launching before the time run now. Okay so this is what I did. I thought I was a genius when I set the timer and opened TikTok. If something is going viral, it probably started here, right? I typed TikTok made me buy it and started scrolling like my life depend on it. But TikTok did not care about my problem. Instead of giving me a million dollar product idea, it showed me teen dancing, a guy crying over his ex a cat in sunglasses and a recipe I never make. My 10 minute strategy was running into 10 minutes of chaos and after 2 minutes I realized something is painful. I was counting on luck and that's what stopped most people resource from happening. People think they will find a great product while they scroll before bread. That's like believing you can become a millionaire by accidentally walking into an open bank wallet. It does not happen. I stopped then shut down TikTok, bred in deeply and I used my secret weapon called Minia. If you have not heard of it, Minia is a data driven spy tool and keep track of ads, product and store on sites like TikTok, Facebook, Pinterest and Shopify. But instead of going over all the features, let's do it right now. The timer says 8 minute left, so let's go now. I opened the product research dashboard first, there is a search bar, so I typed in a bold term like self care, it's a niche that is always in style. Then I add filter for shop now, buy later. And boom, the chaos was over. I was not looking at random things, I was looking at serial winners backed by data. A small LED makeup mirror with built in touch lighting caused my eyes right away. The engagement curve was going up quickly and the comments were all about how people wanted to buy it, not just targeting friends for fun. And that usually means something good. And some of the comments like, I need this for my bag, where do I order? This is perfect for travel. And another is, I've been looking for something like that adding to cart. Upon clicking the ad, Minya provided me with the breakdown of everything. The amount of time, the advertisement has been up, the platform it was operating on and the most active countries viewing the advertisement. This particular product was instantly noticeable thanks to the information provided. The advertisements were not old but current dirty. Buyers are reacting in the present time, not half a year ago. Also, the outlay was no trial budget. The study budget hikes indicated that the advertisement continued to ram up rather than shut the switches off. To top it, the interaction statics were reversed. The percentage of clicks through was high, sales of comments were growing steadily and the activity of most top markets, which typically converts well, was taking place. All in one such cues were indicative of a product that is not only fast enable it is also profitable and is being forcefully marketed today then i click on magic search and that's when the fun began i sent me a screenshot of the mirror and within seconds she found ads and product that were similar on facebook pinterest and tiktok different prices angles and options it's like watching the whole marketing dna of a product come to life in front of you creative style fits in any bag perfect for the on the go touch ups and this price is $19.99. Positioned as a travel must have, perfect for UGC creators who show day in my life clips or on the go routines. Great angle if your audience is student, commuters, or beauty beginners. The next one is vanity style LD mirror, daddy mini desktop version. Glow up vibes, aesthetic beauty deck set of inspiration, and its price range from $39 to $59. This product goes after the aesthetic bedroom decks, Nise, higher AOV premium vibe, great if you are targeting beauty influencers or home decor tickets. Fields. Next, I headed over to the trending soft feature. This tool is not about finding new competitors, it's about validating real performance. I wanted to make sure this product was not just generating hypes in ad, but actually converting into sales. So I looked at the store running the mirror and checked key metrics like traffic trends, estimated daily revenue, top selling items, and active ads. The data back up the potential. The store had consistent traffic growth, several recent winning products, and solid daily revenue, which told me they were not just testing, they were scaling. And seeing this performance helped me confirm that the LD mirror was not just a nice creative, it had real commercial traction behind it. If the numbers had been flat or declining, it would have been a red flag but instead the data stirred my conviction in the product. And in 10 minutes, I went from complete chaos on TikTok to having a product that was not proven to work, proof of traction inside into my competitors and a product page that was ready to go. All of this was based on data, not guesswork. And that's when I realized that the timer was not the real problem, it was getting rid of the idea that product research has to to be hard and stressful. The process is calm, logical, and to be honest, kind of fun when you use a system that shows you what's working in real time. If you want to experience that same shift going from guessing to knowing in just a few minutes, try it for yourself. I even asked Minya to hook up my readers and they gave me a 70% off coupon so you don't have to pay full price. You'll find the link and code below. So that is for today. If you have any questions and queries related to Minya and regarding dropshipping, then definitely comment down below. And before going, hit that red subscribe button and that like button too. And if you want to learn more about dropshipping and AI tool like this, then definitely watch this video now.